How old is the Indus Valley civilization? Earlier, based on radiocarbon dating, it was believed that the civilization was 5,500 years old. But this chronology has been challenged by various researchers and it has been established that Birdhana in Haryana settlement was in fact 8,000 years old. So a team of scientists set out to confirm the validity of this and what caused its downfall. How did they confirm the validity of Birdhana's antiquity? The team of scientists isotopically analysed teeth and bone phosphates excavated from one of the trenches of the Birdhana settlement. They dated pottery fragments from mature and early mature phases by the OSL method. Isotope-based paleoclimatic information also lends support to the antiquity of Harappan settlements at Birdhana. Did climate change lead to the collapse of civilization? There is no evidence of a collapse. Weak monsoon phase existed before 9000 years BP2. Then the monsoon intensified from 9000 to 7000 years BP period and Bhakra Hakra transformed into mighty rivers. From 7000 years BP to mature Harappan phase, weak monsoon phase persisted. During this, the mean annual rainfall was similar to present-day non-monsoon months. Another team of scientists indicates that a 200-year long drought period. But there was no sudden collapse. People adapted to conditions. Settlements not just survived but thrived at most of the sites. People changed the crop pattern and subsistence strategy. They shifted from the large grain cereals like wheat and barley to drought-resistant species of small millets and rice. People moved from large storage systems, one of the features of Harappan sites, to an individual household one. This perhaps led to the de-urbanization and later decline of the Harappan civilization. Multiple factors, agriculture, change in crop pattern, etc., other than climate change, did the civilization in. But we shouldn't ignore the fact that the 200-year drought started this chain of events which culminated in the end of the civilization. These new findings have major lessons for us. We are still over-dependent on monsoon for our agriculture. As far as our water management is concerned, less said the better. Even today, two years of weak monsoons impact the country so adversely.